I'm Kevin Stone, orthopedic surgeon at the Stone Clinic in San Francisco. Today we're going to talk about alternatives to running. So many of us were runners throughout much of our life. It was so efficient, just throw on your sneaks, go out the door and go for a run. And then we get to a point where we really can't run, either due to knee arthritis or to other injuries that hold us back. There are some great alternatives that give that same endorphin rush and fitness feeling as running. And let me just run through a few of those for you that I encourage you to use. One is running in a pool. So the pool in chest deep water, if you run side to side, run 20 laps and then see how long it takes you to do that. And every day run them a little bit faster. Deep water pool running is another way to do it, where you're using high stepping and high hand pumps in the deep water, not moving very much, staying in place and running on time. Huge cardiovascular workout gives you a lot of the same endorphin rush as outdoor running. Another device is called an elliptigo. It's like an elliptical machine in the gym, but it has wheels and goes outdoors. I personally have found this to be the most similar thing to running, and I use it for climbing hills around Mount Tamalpais and Mill Valley and on the flats as well. It gives the same feeling of going for a sprint and doing high, run, high hill climbing while running and really has no impact on the joint and feels great. Obviously the bike and other tools are ways of substitutes for running, but they really don't quite give that same running feeling as an elliptigo or a pool. Uh, and I really encourage you to find these alternatives that do that same fitness feeling, that same endorphin rush as running does without the impact. If you do run, final couple of tips. Short strides, high cadence, soft surfaces, new sneakers, landing on the midfoot in your running shoes really does make a difference, diminishing that high heel impact and, in, and improving your running enjoyment without the pain.